A pleasure to me all at last, and welcome back to Tiny Diecast Fury on HJN Season 3. And what I got to show for today is some more material, of course. There's a lot of episodes I have to work with, and so within the time window that I have set, do expect more than one to be showing up from going on forward, pretty much. But back to Hot Wheels. We have ourselves the Chrysler 300C Hemi. Basically, the Hemi version of the Chrysler 300C. And the 300C itself has been around for a long time. Even to this day, we are seeing new releases of the 300C, which is really something. Most other models out there, like the Sebring, Concorde, and 200, which is basically a smaller variation with a different design and all that. But the 300C, as you can see, up close at least, does have plenty of instances of that sort of boxy look that you might get in most ways possible. And Chrysler's made a lot of innovations in hundreds of different places, especially when it comes to the usage of transmission, safety regulations, designs, and plenty of other unique things. But sadly, we're not really gonna be seeing much of Chrysler at this point in time. They might even go defunct. Who really knows? But because it's a pretty big company in and of itself, and it tends to be a bit of a rival to GM and an amalgamation of others, we're definitely gonna have Chrysler around for a while, considering the fact that they do have ownership of Fiat and Jeep and Dodge and Ram. And I'm more than sure that down the line, we'll be seeing a lot more from them these days than ever before within ownership of other marks. But you know what though? This version really is impressive. A classic silver color with a sunroof on the top, non-tinted windows, which is fine. You have a grill that's nice and detailed, as well as both headlamps and tail lamps. It's pretty unique considering that this release is in fact all the way from 2005 from what I'm seeing here. A copyright date at least points out that it's a 2005 model. And so, with that in mind, thank you very much for watching this pick that I have. And there's a lot more where that came from. As I've said, there will be more than one episode a day going forward. At least to ensure that I get my stuff done within the time allotted. So if you want to see more, go down to my channel to make sure that you like, subscribe, comment, follow me on social media, and stay on the Hollywood side.